Baltimore City going to court today to take on the U.S. Department of Health. The city is suing after funding for its teen pregnancy prevention program was abruptly cut off. WMAR 2 News' Chanel Perriman is live this morning at the federal courthouse. Chanel, city health officials say this came as a complete shock. Yes, Ashley, what was surprising is that the grant was supposed to last five years and was cut off two years early. And city officials say they did not receive an explanation as to why. The city's health department found out about this last July, and they were supposed to still have two years left in the grant and three and a half million dollars. This will cut funding from things like birth control and health education programs and would affect about 20,000 students in the city. Now, according to the health department, the city did see a drop in teen birth rates from 2000 to 2016. There was a 61% drop in the city. Organizations that are now losing funding say this is going to have a big impact on young men and women in the city. The loss of this funding means that we will not be able to test this out for the Spanish speaking population who in fact have the highest rate of teen pregnancy across this country. It also means the loss of a, of a mechanism of delivery that is very much in concert with what young people are doing today in order to get their information. Now, this case is set to head to court for 2 p.m. this afternoon, and we will continue to follow this story. For now, live in downtown Baltimore, Chanel Pearman, WMAR 2 News.